So I wonder, what is wisdom? For me, I think wisdom is three things. I think it's honesty, deep inner honesty, that we live trying to live free of the cunning of the mind, of not manipulating. But most of our education is to be cunning, to get the best of the other fellow, to know how to manipulate, to get, make more money, to have the finest this or that. But I think I don't think that's the answer. I read a lot of biographies, and I find that many of these very, very rich people, these very famous people, they're not happy. And often, they try to commit suicide. So that, for me, is not the answer. I think here at Happy Valley, one wonderful thing that attracts me is the direction of thought that the school is going towards. So, wisdom to me is trying to be inwardly honest. All great teachers have said, you cannot change the world. You can only change yourself. That to me, as we work with it, is wisdom. Then, there are two other things that I think of wisdom, compassion. Because if we're not concerned about people, about our friends, we're monsters. And we're in this really one world. We're all tied together in a mysterious way. We all affect each other. I've had a great deal of trouble in my own life. And let me tell you, I do not always live what I preach because I've been one of these self-centered artists only interested in art. Fortunately, I once read The Life of Annie Besant. I think she is, was such a great human being. And reading her life, made me realize that art was secondary and that people were primary. And it's helped me because I'm very eye-minded and if people come into my life and they're not attractive looking, I'm not interested in them. <laughs> That's not a way to live. The way to live is to live without walls. Now, the third and last thing that I think is wisdom is curiosity. Because if we're just good, we're good for nothing. <laughs> but if we're curious, our mind is open and we're lifted into this extraordinary universe. There is so much to learn in the universe. Uh, I don't know hardly how to begin, but I think the no comes in, that we have to choose and not spend time on things that are wrong. Now, what is wrong? On the other hand, we're here probably the reason we're here is to learn and we learn through our experiences and all our hardships all our heartbreaks they're wonderful because we learn through them i don't like them i've had plenty of them i don't like them at all but through them we get understanding and the important thing is wherever we are when let's say we're making mistakes we're doing wrong things. At least, the important is to keep on trying and trying and trying and never pick it up. And then finally, we touch some understanding, some degrees of why we're here, if there is an answer.